Two organizations in the city of Detroit giving back to those in need in time for Christmas. It happened this afternoon on the city's west side. Priya Mann was there to capture it all. A well-organized line of volunteers busy bagging food for families in need. Avante Graves picked up a box of canned goods, dry milk, pasta, cereal, and non-perishable items. I think it's awesome. Awesome with all that's been going on here lately. A lot of people have been struggling, trying to get by. It's holiday season. I think it's great. Two dozen volunteers have been working feverishly, filling bags and packing boxes. They expect to feed 500 families this holiday season. The pandemic hit this Detroit family especially hard. You know, I just had an uncle just died this morning. I got a phone call about 30 minutes ago. My uncle passed this morning of COVID. So it's just been rough. But receiving help from a lifelong friend was a blessing. This is family, so uh, growing up in the neighborhood, if it's uh, food, if it's back to school, whatever it is, just try to help one block at a time. The nonprofit Youth Are Bigger Than Life partnered with the James H. Cole Legacy Foundation for the holiday food giveaway. Everybody's kind of helping out and making sure everything's going smoothly, and as people pull up, we're delivering the food packages to them, and whatever they need, we're here for them. The funeral home is a black-owned business operating for more than a century. Myself and my brother are fourth generation, and it just means a great deal to be able to continue this great family legacy and to be able to service the people of Detroit. The two organizations bought $6,500 of food from Gleaners and plan to make this an annual event. So weather's not going to stop you, huh? Oh, no, no, not at all. As long as I got my feet and my arms, we're good. <laughs> On Detroit's West Side, I'm Priya Mann, Local 4.